Got to catch up on your soaps? Click CBS.com and relax. Dan, you got to give me some sort of timetable here. This is the best part. You got to check this out, Emily. Fine, fine. Just do the best you can. Goodbye. Damn it. What's wrong? What's wrong? I've got this really touching piece on farmers losing everything. I mean, you talk about a heartbreaking piece, and Dan's telling me he doesn't have the time to edit it. Who cares about farmers? I have romance here, Emily. Singles scene, Oakdale's nightlife. Mm, yeah, and I'll be sure to pass that one along. <laughs> no, Emily. I want my stuff on Hello, Oakdale, and I am talking today. Otherwise, Margot finds out all about your little romp on the rug with Tom. Fine. Fine, give me the damn tape, Molly. Thank you. Just give me the tape. Wait a minute. Oh, Kim, you're just wait a minute. What's the piece? It's really great. I think it captures Oakdale's nightlife. You are going to put her on the air again after that travesty on last night's news? Don't worry, this isn't going to be live. Just I only hush. Get when it... Why has this network become all Molly, all Molly, all the time? Well, I, I think she attracts a certain demographic. We lost. Yes two of our best people yesterday because she was on the news. What I want to know... And you! <clears throat> Why are you putting up with this? I keep them closed, right? They're Tight. closed. No peeking, okay? No peeking. Don't want to ruin my surprise. <laughs> right, come on, a little more, a little more. All right. Now, open them. Place. You cleaned it. Yeah, well, I just wanted it to look nice when you got home. Oh, wow. I would have heart surgery more often. This is really nice. And it feels really good to be home. You know? That's what this place feels like now. You can stay as long as you like. Don't worry about the rent, okay? I got a great job. I make plenty of money. Ooh, construction pays, huh? And it does, all right? So <laughs> you can count on it. This is your place to stay. You don't worry about anything. I counted on you before. And you came through for me. I would have never made it without you, Eddie. Come here. Welcome home, kid. Mm -hmm. Welcome home. Lily? Lily? James. James, what are you doing here? You've known all along. No, I don't. I don't know. I don't know what you've heard, but I don't. I don't know anything. Yeah, hold and kill David. Hold and kill David and bury him. And he thought it could keep it a secret forever. But he told you, and he shouldn't have said that. He shouldn't have never told you. He said it aloud. And you see, I have ears that can hear you in the darkness. No, please don't. Yes. Don't blame Holden. Please, please don't hurt Holden. Hurt Holden? Oh, poor darling. Holden is going to hurt forever. What are you looking for? What are you looking for, Lily? Can you hear my baby? You can hear your baby? You can hear your baby crying? Well, you're gonna hear those cries forever. Because this baby isn't yours. That's hope, that's hope, that's hope. No, was your baby, Lily? Was your baby holding kill David in the prime of his life? He took my child, so I'm taking his. No, you can't do this, please. Oh, yes, I can. I can do anything I want, any time I want. And look at you. You can't even move. Please, James, don't. Please, don't. Please. An eye for an eye. A tooth for a tooth. A child for a child. No, no, please, James, don't. Please. No. Please. My baby just had a No, no, no. No, no oh, it's me. Hi. You okay? Oh, I was just dreaming. I know. I know. No, my, my baby is Your fever is broken. My baby, Your baby is, just... is fine. Your baby is absolutely fine. She's good. She's the best. Oh. Holden called Memorial again this morning. She's thriving. Oh, that's so great. That is so great. Yes. And you? Mm, you look better yourself. Yes, you yeah. do. I'm good. I'm okay. Who are the flowers from? Um, I don't know. Oh, James, with best wishes. What the hell are you doing here? Jack was supposed to come here. Why did he send you? you Why didn't he come Stop whining himself? about Jack Snyder, okay? He didn't send me, but I did happen to overhear him talking to Julia about you. Julia. He's had a belly full of your, uh, crying wolf. Enough to last a lifetime, so I thought I'd better come here and check it out. Oh, I just want to kill her. I want Why to did you forget about her for a minute, okay? How did you get yourself into this mess? 
Well, it's all my damn sister's fault. Look, John, just get me out of here, okay? Just get me out! Not so fast. As the world turns. Are the one I that ought to be in here. You think good. you can do anything you want to be? You have a lot of money. I'm so saying it. Girls, ladies, ladies, please, please. It's very difficult to understand you when you're both talking at the same time. Well, Rosanna, long time no see. Nice to see you, Dr. Dixon. Things are going well for you? Yes, no? things are fine, thank you. Yeah. You? Oh, you know, ups and downs. Oh, ups for Pete's down. sake. Why don't the two of you just go off into a corner and make out or something? Because it's obvious that neither one of you are going to help me. Carly seems to be in a little bit of trouble. Maybe she could explain to me what happened. She came to see me. Mm -hmm. When she didn't get her own way, she lost control. She went berserk. She attacked me. She tried to strangle me, and she trashed a gaming room. Oh, now, now why don't you tell him why there. that is? She dangled that $50 million in front of me. She just dangled it there, and then she snatched it back, and she laughed in my face. Carly, that's not all that I said. You know how much I want that money. You know all I've done for it. I've worked like a dog, mm -hmm. and I can't lose it now. Don't let her take it away from me, John, okay? You can't let her do that. You can see how unstable she is. She got irrational yesterday. I did the right thing committing her. You're a doctor. You can see that. You know what I see when I'm in here? One hell of a mess. And I think you started it, Rosanna, with this trust fund for a baby. You look awful. Sinus pressure, huh? You know how Advil handles your tough pain fast? Well, Advil cold and sinus handles tough sinus pain fast. This is in this, plus a decongestant. That's why they call it Advil cold and sinus. Revlon! Dry lips? Kiss them goodbye. Revlon Moisture Stay Lip Color with vitamin C. Moisture that stays even after I take the color off. Revlon Moisture Stay Lip Color. Bye-bye, dry lips. Revlon! I was happy to have my children. And I think they know that. The whole jar, right? No. Everybody needs to connect as a family. <laughs> Just a simple thing is making dinner. Craft foods. We make it taste good, but you make it feel good. Food brings us together. Let's make something good. It's gotta be the dog chow. Dog chow is made using Purina's advanced scientific knowledge. It has high quality nutrients and ingredients like poultry protein and rice for high digestibility to bring out the best in your dog. Incredible dog food, incredible dogs. Purina dog chow brand. Rolling Stone calls Beloved a film of shocking immediacy. And surpassing tenderness. Something's funny about that gal. Something's happening to me. Fierce emotions. She the one I have to have. Beauty and terror. <laughs> Oprah Winfrey, Danny Glover, and the director of The Silence of the Lambs. You came back to me. Beloved. I know. Rated R. Starts Friday, October 16th. Oh, who's that? That's weird. We just got here. Who could that be? It's probably some doctor coming to cut you open, man. Ah, oh, that's funny, Silver. Hi, Maxwell's. We got the stuff you ordered this morning? Stuff. You know what? You must have oh, it wrong. Oh, nope. They're right. Oh, they're right. Down the way. Bring it in, guys. Bring it in. Bring it in. And wait, just wait. put it over George, here. Wait, 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 wait. Guys, 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 guys. Oh. Where are you going? Wait, wait, wait. Georgia, I told you that I was making good money, okay? I could pay the rent. I could put food in the fridge, new furniture. No, not going to happen. Relax. Look, look, look. Okay. You guys, guys, take You're this fine, off. Put guys. it back in the trunk. Take it back to the You're store. Fine. We can't afford Georgia. We can't afford this stuff. We can. All right, guys, just bring it on in. Bring it on in. Are you kidding me? Where did it's you okay. get that money? It's Where okay. did you get that money? Maybe we can't afford new furniture, but Auntie Lou can. Here, guys. Wait a second. You know what? Here's, Here's an what extra you, for you. Saying? Thanks. You're Thank welcome. Extra. Pin, pin. All right. What are you talking about? Lucinda sent one of her flunkies over today and gave me flowers and a wad full of cash. 
darling, to tide you over till I return. <laughs> no way. Yeah. So I got a catalog from one of the nurses, and I let my fingers do the shopping. Yeah, you did. You did let your fingers yeah. do the shopping. Look at all yep. this stuff. It's great. I hope you like and it. I, yeah, I, lo I love it, but... I wanted to repay you for everything that you did for me while I was in the hospital. It meant a lot, Eddie. Are you sure that that old Balax isn't going to blow her lid when she finds out about this? Well, I mean, she said I could spend it on whatever I liked, you know? So, oh, this is so cool. It's a chair that you blow up. And I don't know how comfortable it is, but it was pretty cheap, so, you know? Yeah, I, uh, I had one of these before. Margo, uh, Margo bought one for my room. Ooh, um, you know what? I'll take it back. No, 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 no. Don't take it back. What? Don't, don't take it back. They work great once you get them blown up. See, look, yeah. it, even, it even comes with a pump. But I don't want it sitting around, you know, bringing you bad energy because I know you still have feelings for yeah, her. Yeah, yeah, sometimes I think about Margot, okay, but... <sighs> I know how you feel. Uh, you know, I, um, I used to think that I would never get over Margot Hughes, that um, I'd never find another woman that I cared about. Lately, I've been starting to realize that maybe Margot isn't the only woman in the world. Oh, Mama, are you sure? All right, all right, I'll let you know how she takes it. Yeah, assuming I'm still in one piece. I hope so, Mama. Oh, okay, I love you too. Bye. Andy, you startled me. Sorry, I'll start singing as soon as I hit the property line. Would you? What's that? Tape. No kidding. It's Casey's tape. Not my Casey, but Casey Peretti's. Remember, he wanted to leave a message to little Katie because he knew the end was so near? And Katie gave it to you? No, she's never heard it. She doesn't even know it exists. You mean Lila never? No. Mama never told her what really happened. She's been asking so many questions about her dad lately. Is that the tape? Yeah. On... Yeah. The first part is his message to little Katie, and the second part, remember, the tape was left on and accidentally recorded his asking me. To pull the plug? Yeah. And you're gonna let Katie hear that? Well, don't you think she should? I mean, it was Casey's last request that I do that. It didn't make it any easier, but... You did what he wanted you to do. I know, it's just that Katie and I are just getting to know each other now for the first time. Now, how's she going to react when she finds out that it's her big sister who disconnected her father's life support system? I think she'll understand. Give her some credit. I don't know. I don't know. But she's asking me about him all the time. So I called Mama and I asked her if I should let her hear the tape. And she said, yeah, go ahead. She's a big girl. There you go. I don't know. I'm scared. I mean, what if it backfires in my face? Oh, hey, Andy. How you doing? Good, Katie. How are you? Good. Oh, I guess today's the day I'll find out. Kim, I, I have to say, I, I trust Emily's judgment. You mean to tell me, after what happened last night, you don't mind if Emily puts Molly back on the air again? Uh, not on the news. I mean, not with me. She was horrible. She was worse than horrible, but I just work here. Uh, Emily does run the news department. I want to talk to you in my office. Now. Tom, I want to thank you for being so cool about all my mistakes and for helping me get another chance. You know what? I'm not cool about any of this. I think we all know how you got on the air. Please don't be mad at me, Tom. Look, we're co-workers now, so we're we not really co-workers. I'm a journalist. You are a blackmailer. I just wish I could make you understand how dangerous this is. Not just for me, for you. You threatening me? Because if you are, all it takes is one little phone call. And Tom and Emily's little secret is There blown is out. no Tom and Emily. It's finished. It's over. I don't think Emily sees it that way.
No matter how pure a soap claims to be, it will dry out your skin. Dove is not a soap. In fact, its moisturizing lotion leaves you feeling softer, smoother, more like you. Maya got branches. Maya got branches. Maya got prawns. Maya got prawns. Nothing spreads more smiles than French's classic yellow, hearty deli, mild Dijon, and new honey mustard. Smile, you got branches. You remember that? that oh boy. <laughs> yeah, you were 12, a hot dog in each hand. I reached up and snatched that ball right out of the sky. Now this time, the hot dogs are on me. Uh, I wish I could. Oh, but Dad, you can. Take this Pepsi AC before you eat. Heartburn stops before it starts. Before I eat? Yep. You get us the hot dogs, and I'll get us another foul <laughs> ball. Yeah. You can be heartburn free with Pepsi AC. You do better on coats for the entire family at Burlington Coat Factory. You can find the same coats that you find in department stores with the same name brands, but for a lot less money. They have leather jackets, raincoats, winter coats, down coats, any type of coat you want. I love it here. It's a great savings. You'd be crazy to think about shopping for coats anywhere else. Shopping in Burlington Coat Factory is like putting money in the bank. Burlington Coat Factory, we're more than great coats. Stop by aisle five for Clairol's herbal essences. It takes you where no shampoo is gone before. With all natural botanicals and organic herbs in pure mountain water, it will leave your hair looking beautiful. Yes! 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 If you think that's great, try the body wash. <laughs> Clairol's herbal essences, a totally organic experience. On this day in Late Show history, there was no Late Show. It was Saturday. But tonight, Dave makes history with Isabella Rossellini and Stephen Baldwin. If anything, Emily wants you more than ever. Well, she's an adult. She's responsible. She's not going to play out some twisted version like you did chasing Holden around. She knows it's over? Yes, she knows. I told her. By the way, I wasn't threatening you. I was trying to be nice to you. Here's a threat. You breathe one word of this to Margo, and you answer to me. Do you understand? I have more people to worry about than just myself. I have my family. I have my wife's feelings, and Adam and Casey, and I love them. Just think back to when you were a kid, how much this would have hurt to learn something like this about one of your parents. I can't do that to my family. I love them. Please, Molly, tell me you understand at least some of what I'm talking about. I've got to go. Miss Conlon. Nice talking to you. The epitome of charm, that young woman. It's a bad time? <clears throat> no, no. It's fine. What's wrong? Is it what I think? Did you tell Margo? No, Dad, I didn't tell her. I, I couldn't do it to her or the boys, and I'm afraid that it might just break her after losing the baby. But I'll promise you this. I'm going to spend every minute, every waking hour, trying to make this up to her. You're not saying anything, Dad. So I told you. I, I'm not you, and I can't judge you. You have to make this decision. Thank you for being there when I needed somebody to talk to. I just hope it works out. Thanks, Dad. All right. Well, hi, honey. Hey. What are you doing here? Oh, I'm just checking up on my uh, my son, the star TV anchor man. Oh, yeah, he's on his way. <laughs> so, what's up? Can't cut your tongue. 
That's the big secret. This whole idea of putting a price tag on Carly's firstborn, you know, that's sort of sick. I mean, have a baby, Carly, and make yourself $50 million. What sort of person would do that? I'm not proud of it, Dr. Dixon. No, well, I think it's both of you, really. You know, you made the offer, and she jumped at it. Maybe the two of you should be locked up in a padded cell in this joint. Look, there was a lot going on in my life when I made this I trust. realize yeah. that. I remember all about Mike. Yes. Have a baby, Carly, with anybody except Mike. It's a great way to eliminate the competition. You're really enjoying this, Of course, I didn't care much for Mike Kazanoff one way or the other, but I gotta take my hat off to a guy who can cause this much insanity. Look, I was very angry when I made that trust, and I regretted it, okay? Mm. Would you please stop berating me like this? If you regretted it so much, then why didn't you just cancel it? What do you make your sister jump through hoops like this for? Cancel it and be done with it once and for all. Then shut up! Whose side are you on, anyway? Frankly, I wish that I could. I wish I could end this whole business right now and give the $50 million to some babies who need it. Mm. But I can't. I made the trust irrevocable. Carly meets the terms, she gets the money. There's nothing you can do to stop it. Please, just make sure she doesn't hurt the baby. Oh, way to go, John. Oh, that's great, just listening to you stick it to her like that. It's almost worth spending night in this loony bin. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Should we blow this pop stand? Wait a minute. We're not going anywhere. I want those flowers out of here. I want you to get them out oh, now. darling, he feels terrible about David and what he did, and he saved your life. And for that, Stop I'm eternally Stop doing great. that. Stop what? I'm not going to sit here and listen to you defend James. Darling, he saved your life. Now, that counts for something to me. Fine. Fine, I will thank him. Thank you, you. You know he is still the same disgusting human being he has always been. Now, if you're going to sit here and defend him, you can go out with the flowers. I want you to take Please, them out. Please, dear. Don't get yourself all exercised about this. Don't make excuses for that slime. You don't know that my so-called rescue, it could have been a setup by James. Honey, that's paranoid. Why? To what end? To make you eternally grateful. Oh. You're a smart woman. You know, if he's acting this way, pretending that he has changed, he wants something. I don't know what it is, and I don't care. But all I know is I want James Stenbeck out of my life for good. Yes? Hello, Lily. How are you feeling? James, we were just talking about you. Really? Then I assume that you've uh, shared the big news? No, my mother hasn't shared any news. You don't need a license for hair like this. All you need is Preference by L'Oreal. Stay true colorants that resist fading mean my color won't fade out. Special conditioners mean my hair won't dry out. With Preference, I love my color, and I'm worth it. Fade resistant Preference by L'Oreal. Chocolate milk? This isn't ordinary chocolate milk. It's rich chocolate Ovaltine. Compare the labels. It's got vitamins. Nestle Quick has none. When it comes to nutrition, Ovaltine beats Quick hands down. For us, it's rich chocolate Ovaltine. More Ovaltine, please! overactive bladder that strong sudden urge having to go so often the fear of wedding accidents if you're one of the millions who live with some of these symptoms there's something you should know overactive bladder isn't normal at any age and your doctor has treatments that can help you need a break i can wait these treatments can help reduce the symptoms of an overactive bladder you want to go back in a while overactive bladder isn't normal at any age so talk to your doctor today about treatments that can help Specially priced at $14.99. A warm reminder that at Red Lobster, the season isn't over. It's a world of magic surprises and fun when Mickey and Minnie play. A rattle for you, shooting a boo. Just a touch brings magic your way. It's a world of magic, a world of fun with Minnie and Mickey Mouse. Soft and snuggly, give them a touch, they'll crawl around the house. Get three dollars off Disney Touch and Crawl Babies at participating stores before they crawl away. Touch and Crawl and Touch and Surprise Babies from Disney They're magic, they're laughter, they're fun. Inside an ER for kids, 48 hours tonight.
What if a kidnapper called you by mistake? Yes, hello. I need 400,000 or the kid dies. And put the life of a child in your hands. All new diagnosis after Promise Plan, CBS Tonight. Friday. And your, your song is? Tom Jones. Kids sing the darndest things. It's not a new shoe. Bill Cosby, kids say the darndest things. Then, you're on a nature walk. It's a tall road now. Would you pay to hike or tell him to take one? That's a bunch of crap, sir. All new Candy Camera after Kids Say, CBS Friday. Just what is this news, Mother, and why haven't you told me? Uh, well, that, that I'm, I'm moving back to Oakdale. Yeah. He's moving back to Oakdale. Yes, I've got a, some new business ventures. Really? Will yeah. you be listed in the yellow pages under G for gangster? <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Everything from now on in, in my life, Lily's going to be strictly within the confines of the law. I might appeal to you to know that uh, his deal with the U.S. government, the pardon will be revoked if there's even one little slip-up. Oh, <laughs> I wonder when that will happen. Oh. Funny thing. We were just talking about you, James, and Lily was saying to me how much she wanted to thank you for the flowers. Yes. Thank you. I'm, I'm, I'm really not up for visitors right now. Oh, then, then, I, then I won't stay long, but I do have just, just a couple of questions about David. You see, the authorities have drawn a complete blank. There's not a trace of him anywhere, and that, that just doesn't make any sense. David will never go near our child again. I know because he's dead. I killed him. Lily, is there anything, anything at all that you can remember that might help me find my son? <laughs> well, nothing's going on. I mean, there's, there's no secret to that. I, I was just having a personal problem and getting some advice from Dad. So. Oh, well, is there anything I can do? For no, no, it's gonna be, it's gonna be fine. It's, it's not, nothing to worry about. Well, good. Well, he is. He's handling it fine. If I can do anything for you. Well, sure, I'll, I'll call. Terrific. All right, I brought this in. I thought you should look at it. It's about the fire on oh. Archer Street last okay, night. Thanks. Okay, thanks. Thanks. See you later. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry I put you on the spot like that. I don't like doing that to my dad. Uh, I, I have to say, uh, it is a little uncomfortable not telling Kim. Uh, secrets and infidelity are loaded subjects in my home. Dad, if you can keep a lid on this, I would appreciate it, I think. It'd be best for everybody if we just put this behind us and move on. I think everybody would be better off. So, uh, if you want any of these photos blown up, I'll put them in your album for you. Great. Thanks, okay. Andy. I guess I'll take off. Thank you. See you, Katie. Bye. Wrong. Nothing. Um, just, um, just talked to Mama a little while ago on the phone, and we were talking about how you've been asking about your father lately, and I think I have a way of your dad answering all the questions you have. What do you mean? I, I, I don't understand. I know you don't. I know there's a lot of things about your father's death that you don't understand. Oh, God, this is so hard. Please just bear with me. See, the thing is that your, your father was sick for a real long time before he finally passed away. You know that. And there are all sorts of things that he wanted to... preparations he wanted to make. And one of them is that he was worried about you, his little Katie. So... He made a recording. He made a tape for you. What? There's a tape? I never heard any tape. Yeah, I know you didn't, because after he passed away, it was a real difficult time for all of us. And you were so little, you were so young. Yeah, but Mom would have known about this tape. Why didn't she let me hear it later? Mom had a really difficult time, too, with what happened. So, as I said, I just spoke to her, and um, we agreed that you should hear the tape now. You have it? Oh, my God. 
His voice is on this tape. You know what, baby? You don't have to hear it right now. You can wait, okay? No, no, I, I, I want to hear it. Okay, then I'll, I'll just give you your privacy. No, wait, Margo, please. I really want you to stay with me. going on here, John? You came here to get me out of here, so come on, let's go! I think that's a good idea. What? Maybe the good doctors and nurses of this place can get something through that thick skull of yours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I shouldn't have tried to strangle my sister, okay? I got that. Come on, can we go? Listen to you! You have absolutely no idea of the risk you put that baby at. I didn't. And I wouldn't. I love this baby. You have a strange way of showing it, Carly. Crashing automobiles, getting yourself kidnapped, traipsing halfway across the country to some casino, and winding up in a nut house. John. If I go through that door, and I talk to these doctors, and I get you released, it will be under one condition. Anything. And that is that you agree to be in my custody. shower is more than just a ritual. With Oil of Olay body wash, it's a place to feel renewed. As the rich cleansing lather pulls away the last whispers of sleep, you are awakened. And when Olay with nurturing moisturizers softens and smooths your skin, you discover there's a simple joy in being clean and feeling cared for. But feeling is believing, so prove it yourself and start each day with Olay body wash instead of soap. Family get-togethers. They're lots of fun, lots of food, lots of mess, and take a lot more green to help get them clean. But not with Joy. Joy's so strong, just a spoonful does a sinkful. You'd need twice as much green to equal Joy's power to cut the toughest grease. So you use less, and using less is the real Joy. Ultra Joy, the little spoonful that does a sinkful. Open wide, it's new Frisky's Dental Diet. Boys, here's great taste of news you can chew. If you want strong choppers, you gotta keep them clean. Whoa, remember this guy? Never brushed. New Frisky's Dental Diet helps reduce plaque and tartar buildup by 25%. So now your cat can feast on Frisky's and crunch his teeth clean with every bite. Toothbrushes? Ah, oh, poor humans. New Frisky's Dental Diet. Bring out the Frisky in your cat. Bit by bit, bite by bite, gonna twist your noodle tonight. Introducing the Hamburger Helper Supreme line. Try new Italian Parmesan. Twist your noodle, change your mind. I switch. So we. To Northland. Ocean Spray Cranberry Cocktail is just 27% juice. But Northland Cranberry Juice blends are 100% juice. Naturally sweetened with apple and grape juice. Northland. Always 100% juice. Stay tuned for more of As the World Turns. Lives are on the line. Children's lives. Just third degree burns all the way down. Heartbreak 120. I'm a dad here. What would you do? This little guy is seven years old. He's struck by a car. Breathing okay, buddy? This ER is for kids. She could die from this? Yes. Save my child. 48 hours tonight. Hollywood Squares, tonight at 7.30, only on CBS2. It was almost dinner time. They were hungry. I needed something fast but good. I had stopped by Stater Brothers and saw this Campbell's Dinner Ideas display. Found great meals I could make in no time. Chicken quesadillas made with Campbell's cheddar cheese soup. Chicken and broccoli Alfredo. Even spaghetti and meatballs made with thick, rich Prego sauce. And this week, I saved on my favorite Campbell's brands with Stater Brothers' everyday low prices. Is it dinner? Is it ever. Thanks to Stater Brothers and Campbell's, it's dinner in minutes. Everything has changed. My back, my feet, my front, of course.
course. There's a website all about health. Your health. And what are you happy? Oh, it's a she. She's a girl. MyLifePath.com from Blue Shield of California. It gives you discounts on alternative care. It even emails you personalized newsletters. I'll see you in 18 days. MyLifePath.com. Free to all Californians. Nobody knows me like me. From Jennifer Convertibles and Jennifer Leather, it's no interest, no payments, no down payment. For one year, you don't pay anything for one full year. For a limited time only, at Jennifer Convertibles and Jennifer Leather. An all-new Diagnosis Murder, CBS Tonight. But Lily, you spent all that time with David. He must have said something, some, something that would give you a hint, a, a clue, or something where he was going. Uh, James, I told the police everything that I know. I hope that he's on another continent by now, frankly. No, no, he's, he's not. I, I don't understand. Well, no, I mean, no, he's here somewhere. I mean, I have a whole fleet of specialists out there looking. And wherever he is, I'm going to find him. Look, um, I think, James, please, hmm. I think she's had enough. Maybe another time? Oh, uh, okay. yes, I'm, I'm sorry. Another time it, it shall be. Uh, Lily, I hope the flowers make you feel better. Oh, darling! There was no need for you to do that. There are plenty of patients in this hospital who would like to have some flowers. Oh, God. I can't follow you sometimes. Yes. Uh, yes, Max, what? Well, were you able to... Did you did you check Miss Tucker out of the hospital? Is it... What do you mean she wasn't there? Where is she? I see. Well, maybe she's with the... The Silva boy. His name is Eddie Silva. Look him up in the phone. In the phone book, all right? And then find her. Idiots. 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 What is that about? <sighs> Darling, you have a new cousin. It's kind of like art, huh? Art who? <laughs> you know, pop art, blob art, pop, whatever. Blob art? What, you hang this on the wall? I don't think so. Looks more like a pillow, man. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, who is that? I'm telling you, Georgia, if this is more furniture, it's I'm not. telling you to take it back. This is it. Can I, uh, help you? Miss Georgia Tucker? Do I look like Miss Georgia Tucker? Let him in, Eddie. Look, Max, I'm fine, okay? You can tell Aunt Lucinda to relax. She was most upset when you didn't wait for me to drive you to her estate this morning. Wait a second, Georgia. What's going on here, huh? Come on. I kind of bolted on Max this morning. He's the guy that brought the flowers and the envelope, right? Uh -huh. Look, tell Lucinda that I'm going to crash here and that Eddie's going to take perfect care of me. That's right, I'm going to take uh, perfect care of me. But Ms. Walsh has hired medical professionals. You know, I really must advise that we go... Hey, hey, space. Max, what are you doing? Put the suitcase down. Now. You see, this is my estate, okay? So I say what's what. And I say, Georgia, you want to stay? Yes. Yeah, she wants to stay. Come on, we're going. Sir, go I on, really out. must advise out. that Ms. Walsh would not approve. You know what? I don't give a damn what Miss Walsh approves of, okay? So I'm really gonna have to advise that you get the hell out of my house now. Thank you very much. Close the door behind you. Thank you, Eddie. <laughs> How was that? Huh? It was perfect. Yes. You're the best. <laughs> I really like the part where you waved. And blew me kisses. And I caught every one. So I'm sending them back to you. Kisses and great big bear hugs. So when you look in the sky and you see a shooting star, that's a kiss from me. And when you wake up from a good dream, feeling warm and safe, that's a bear hug from me, okay? I love you very much with all my heart, and I always will. 
Oh God, why did he have to die? <laughs> Ever notice how bright things are when you look at them through a bottle of Walter's white grape juice? Everything kind of glows. Same when you drink it. it. Tastes kind of bright. And clear. And it sort of dances on your tongue. Mom says it's Walter's Niagara grapes that are doing it. Walter's white grape juice comes in lots of other flavors. All 100% juice. I'd love to look through them, but I'd rather drink them. Trains now go 300 miles an hour. Mail, 3,000 miles a second. Athletes continually break records. So how come pain relief isn't faster? Introducing Advil Liquid Gels, the first and only pain reliever in a faster-acting liquid-filled capsule that's gentle on your stomach. On tough pain, Advil Liquid Gels are stronger and faster than extra-strength Tylenol. Headaches to muscle aches. New Advil Liquid Gels, advanced medicine for pain. Just got faster. Introducing new Jergens Moisturizing Cleanser. The first facial cleanser with vitamin E microbeads that dissolve as you cleanse to release nourishing vitamin E. Jergens, now cleanse and nourish your face. You have smooth, beautiful skin waiting to be revealed. Jergens Skin Smoothing Lotion with beta hydroxy to gently exfoliate and smooth your skin. Jergens, it nourishes your skin. Viruses, bacteria, even illness may be creeping into your home because mice can carry disease. So put Decon Mouse Proof Baits wherever mice feed to get rid of the threat fast. Decon Mouse Proof. Protect your home. Protect your family. When your dishes don't come out completely clean, you can either scrape them, rewash them, or change your detergent. Electrosol tabs have a blue layer that breaks up tough stains and a white layer that scrubs your dishes to a shine. The first time. Electrosol tabs. Oh my god, he couldn't even breathe. I need to talk to you while I can. Casey. No, Margo. I'm a doctor. I don't think you need to hear the rest of that tape today. Marco? Yeah. You, you sound strange. Um, Katie and I were just talking about her dad. Oh, uh, I'm sorry I interrupted. No, it's okay. Oh, we're gonna be fine. What's up? I was hoping I could get you out on a date. Yeah, I mean, after everything we've been through, I think it's something we could use just a little... I just want to remind you how much I love you. I love you, too. Then how about we meet up on our rooftop? I'll, I'll set it up just right. Oh, honey, you don't, have to, you don't have to go that much trouble. All we need is just us. Honey, for you, I could never go to too much trouble. I'll see you there. I love you, Tom. I love you, too. Sounds like you and Margo are, um... Yeah, we, uh, we have some catching up to do. Listen, before you leave, um, if you could help me out, I need for you to put some things on tape. We're doing some promos. You know what? I, I can't. Uh, I'm already off the clock. I checked out a while ago. I, I really need to get going. I'll see ya. No, Emily. I want my stuff on Hello Oakdale, and I am talking today. Otherwise, Margot Hughes is going to learn all about your little romp on the rug with Tom. Um, Kim, do you have a minute? Yes. I, I've been thinking. Uh, I thought about what you said, and I think you're right. There's absolutely no way Molly can work here. Emily, I don't need your permission to hire or fire anybody. 
Well, right, I, I realize that, but, well, the trouble is, I, um, I'm a little uncomfortable with the idea of firing Molly. She can be a real loose cannon sometimes, and I thought maybe she'd handle it better if she heard it from you. Better? Yeah. It's just so overwhelming, you know, it made me feel sick. Yeah, I know. It's real hard hearing him struggle like that, especially knowing what it means. Yeah. But I want to listen to it again. I want to listen to it every day. Plus, I have to hear the rest of it. <clears throat> yeah, the rest of it. You know what? Why don't I make a copy of this tape for you? Yeah, I'd like that. Thank you. I think it's what your dad would have wanted. I just keep thinking. I just wish he could have lived just a little bit longer, you know? Just a little longer. I never even got a chance to tell him goodbye. Hey, Eddie, I'm gonna go see if this fits the bathroom floor. Hey, you be careful, all right? Don't I hurt will. yourself. I will. Okay. Georgia, come in here, quick, man. I'm gonna be on TV. Hurry up. Hurry up! Mm, so what's this fantasy man like? My dad. I never knew him well. He died when I was a little kid. But I lived with him and my mom here in Oakdale. So I'm just kind of rediscovering some childhood memories. Fascinating. But wouldn't you like to share your private place on the river with your own Mr. Wright? Well, maybe someday. But for now, I just really like spending time there alone. Thinking of my dad and not really feeling sad or lonely. I don't know. I just... I'm not ready for Mr. Wright yet. Well, you know what they say. That's when he's most likely to come along. <laughs> Let's see what Brad Snyder, a construction foreman, has to say. Hi, Brad. Hi, Molly. So tell me, Brad, um... It fits perfectly, mm -hmm. thank what goodness, because the old one was disgusting and gross. Idea of the perfect what are you watching? Girl. What is this, Oakdale's version of the love connection or something? Well, it's, it's nothing. It's crap. There is so much crap on TV, huh? Even with cable. You want to play a game or something? No, I am. Um, I'm not in the mood for games. I'm sorry. Eddie, am I talking too much? Well, oh, you're not talking too much. Come on, don't be ridiculous. Maybe you should go for a walk and get some fresh air before you go to work. Well, what are you going to do? Recuperate. <laughs> Veg out, watch TV, whatever. You sure? Yeah, totally. You should go. Yeah. Okay, I'm going. I'll be back later, okay? okay. Oh, I better leave this here. Hey, you don't do a thing while I'm gone, right? You put your butt on the couch, <laughs> grab the remote, you watch some TV, you do nothing. All okay? right, yeah. All right. See you later. I'll just sit here and wait for you to come home. Well, she turned out to be legitimate, you know? Fig <laughs> figuratively speaking. I can't believe Sam never said anything. I, that poor girl. Oh, honey, don't, don't, don't waste your pity on her. I'm gonna need your help with her, because heart condition or not, she's a handful. Any word from Sam? No, nothing, nor Kirk. So what does James know about Kirk and Sam's disappearance? Nothing. Nothing. Oh. And you think that's true? I'm sure of it. I'm not. Mrs. Snyder, time for those x-rays. Ah. Think about what I said, Mother. Yes, dear. Yes, 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 yes. Tell me, why do you refuse to see this man for what he really is? Sweetheart, my own true love, Lily. I live in the present. This is the man that saved your life in the present. All right, now take her away, and I'll be here when you get back. I thought you left. No, no, I was waiting for Lily to leave so that you and I could be alone. We don't have anything to talk about. Of course we do. I really liked the way you defended me to Lily. I, I felt that I had a, 
a true ally there. An ally. So I... Does that mean you've decided to accept my proposal? No, it means nothing of the sort. Oh, I see. Just, uh, testing the waters to see how the family would react to you being Mrs. James Stenbeck. What utter nonsense. No. Oh, well, I think I understand. And you're right. That's exactly what a lady should do. She should, she should have a little bit of a holding pattern until there's, well, proper substantiation. I mean, did you think I'd forgotten? Forgotten what? My mom says I look just like the Gerber baby. I've changed a bit. And so has Gerber. Now they don't have any added sugar or starch in over 100 recipes. Shouldn't your baby be a Gerber baby? If you want to feel your freshest and your softest, there's only one move you can make. Fresh deodorant caress. Deodorant freshness plus caress softness. It's a feeling like never before. Before you dress, caress. Another trip to the laundromat? Yeah, this is too big for my machine. Well, right now, Sears has a super-capacity Kenmore washer and extra-large dryer, just $299.99 each. You save $70 on the pair. Kenmore? For that? Yeah, and there are all kinds of savings at Sears Laundry Spectacular. Buy any washer or dryer over $399 with your Sears card and get 0% finance charge till March 99. Wow. And if it's Kenmore, Sears will even deliver it free. So I can really save big. Huge, if you hurry, and Saturday. You know, it's no big secret why Jimmy Dean's sausage tastes so great. A lot of people got part of the secret growing in their garden. Fresh, authentic, whole ground herbs and spices. Not some oil or extract. Uh-uh. The real stuff. And it's a flavor that, well, I think it's the best. And it's a flavor that you can only get with Jimmy Dean. Why don't you give it a try? Only the best. That's the Jimmy Dean way. Somewhere there's a job where you can take time off for a cold. Where someone will cover for you when you can't stop coughing. But until you find that job, there's Hall's Mentholiptus. Hall's Vapor Action goes right to work, soothing your throat, calming your cough. No one has time to be sick, but Hall's will keep you going when you are. Hall's, we're going to work. All right. You have your own room, your own bed. Right straight through there. Yeah, well, I do have my own home, you know. Hal moved out. I will be fine there. You're not living alone anymore. You were released into my care, you remember? And that is rule number one of the day. John Dixon. When did that happen? Oh, boy. Well, sounds like internal bleeding. Yeah. All right, I'll be there as soon as I can. Thank you. Bye-bye. Relax. You can go. Obviously, someone needs saving far more than I do. And I could use some sleep. That is, unless, of course, you have some sort of guardian-type activities planned for today. No funny business. You don't try any of your tricks, okay, Collie? I'll have you committed to a psych ward here in Oakdale. I'll be back. Yes, sir. I'm not going to be anyone's prisoner. into Dr. Dixon's care. I think he was taking her home. Well, thank you for informing me. You're very welcome. Jordy, hi. Hey, how's the travel business treating you? Listen, 
Do you think you can book me a flight? Oakdale, Illinois. James. No. Here. No, I want nothing. I'm not, I'm not going to... No, I want nothing to do with that. I really don't. Um, now, at least put it on w while you're making your decision. I have made my decision, James. I have... Don't. What are you doing? That looks ridiculous. Get up. My lady, your hand. <laughs> Get up. That's silly. Your hand. <laughs> um, I would like to send a, a dozen roses, please. They're from a Mr. Tom Hughes, and they're going to his wife, Margot Hughes. Well, that's right. Wow. <laughs> It's like, nice to see that you've got your customers' uh, names and addresses on file, I get. Yeah, yeah, I'm sorry. They, he would like a card attached to the flowers. Um, and it should read, Margo, meet me at the studio. Change of plans. The romance begins here. Love, Tom. You don't know what you're doing. If you fire me, Kim, somebody is going to pay. Yeah, yeah, I'm still here. Uh, do you need anything else from me? I've got to go. Okay, great. Uh, can you put a rush on that order, please? Thank you. Better hurry. Loose cannon is ready to blow. that your baby would do anything to enjoy the feeling of air against her bare skin. Introducing Pampers Baby Dry, our first breathable regular diaper ever. Its new microvent cover lets air flow in and out, so delicate skin stays drier, and it helps your baby feel cooler than before. Pediatricians know air helps keep skin healthy, and with new Pampers Baby Dry, it's one step closer to wearing nothing at all. Uh, it's cold. My throat. It's so sore. You gave me this cold. Oh, you gave it to me. You gave it to me. You gave it to you me. Got it. You got it. Enough. We gotta keep moving here. I'll take it, Dayquil. Take it what? You know, Nyquil for night. Dayquil for day. I'm taking these. <laughs> I won't touch a cough or headache. We'll see. Like the complete relief of Nyquil? You'll love non-drowsy Dayquil. Oh, you guys are doing great. <laughs> Dayquil. The non-drowsy congested stuffy head sore throat coughing aching fever so you can get through the day medicine. My mama, she makes the best chicken cacciatore this side of Italy. The best! But sometimes I get heartburn from my mama's cacciatore. So before I come over, I take a Pepsi AC. Forgive me, mama. Mio figlio adora il mio pollo alla cacciatore. Però io dopo un pezzettino che indigestione. Devo prendere un Pepsi AC. Before a meal or after, Pepsi AC lets you eat the food you love. <laughs> you can be heartburn free with Pepsi AC. Organ rejection. It's one of the biggest risks in heart transplants. But now, an experimental bone marrow procedure may be the answer. Details tonight on the CBS Evening News. CBS Sunday. A special young man. He may be different, but he's my friend. He's threatened by fear. I'm going to put that guy away where he belongs. <laughs> Untouched by an angel. Then, a working mom, a billionaire bachelor. They had nothing in common until a twist of fate brought them together. A marriage of convenience. CBS Sunday. dinner time, Walt. How come you're eating breakfast? Well, which dinner is it? You know, Cliff? We're Becoming dependent on others to push me around in and out of my home. 